Yes, welcome to another episode of More Photography. This is part two of our road trip to Kvitsøy. So we are currently in the cabin and it is a wonderful cabin. Just look at this view. So this is our balcony. So that is a really good view to have on a cabin. So I've already been uh, doing some pictures out here. You have these different types of birds out here. I'm not quite sure what it's called in English, but it you have the Erfugl, the arrogant bird, uh, and some other birds as, as well. So I can probably show them and then just put the bird name down in the corner. So yeah, that is uh, a good day to start the day. And um, our plan for the rest of the day is to head out to this lighthouse at Kvitsøy, which is like the main attraction. And just do some long exposures, uh, some sunsets, and hopefully some Milky Way. Uh, it has been raining the whole day, but right now it's breaking up. And there the forecast is saying that it's going to be at least some clear skies tonight. It's gonna to be clouds, but also little clear skies. So cross fingers for the Milky Way, but otherwise I think it's gonna be a nice with a sunset. The sunset is gonna be nice. So yeah, let's see. All right, so I hope you stay tuned and enjoy the episode. So it seems to be two of these airfugles that are roaming around here a lot. Uh, one of them seems to be a juvenile because it doesn't have the coating as the other one. Uh, but yeah, it's kind of cool to take pictures of them. They seem to be quite used to people. I think maybe some people are actually feeding them here. So yeah, I have done a lot of pictures, a lot of video. Uh, I never had this bird before on uh, pictures. So it's quite cool to get so many. Uh, sharp uh, pictures and videos of it and it's so close to it. I think it's like Sometimes it was like 10 15 meters away, especially if you just sit here and wait They kind of get used to you and they come really close. So I got some really good pictures Yeah, so the weather has been quite good today. There was a little bit of uh, Afternoon breeze, but anyways the weather is good and yeah, I think the pictures are good. So I hope you like it.
Alright, so this is the famous Kvitsoy Lighthouse. So I am back here today. I was here earlier, but then it was kind of impossible to vlog because of some construction work going down here. It made a lot of noise, so I just skipped the vlog then and thought I would come back during sunset. So uh, I am back, of course, and it's close to sunset. But the only problem is that the whole horizon has is covered in clouds. That's the clouds that was from earlier today. So they have yet not disappeared, but there is kind of clear skies above. So there's a good chance for some Milky Way or at least some star, uh, starscape photography or nightscape photography, I mean. But I've put up my camera here again, uh, kind of doing the same thing as I did earlier today. I'm using the my filter system here. So I have the polarizer here to remove or get some more clarity in the sky. So it removes the highlights a little bit. And then I'm using the ND1000 here to get this long exposure. So I'm currently doing a 30 second long exposure to like uh, get the uh, clouds smooth. Uh, and then I'm also using a light grad gradated filter to make the sky darker and the foreground brighter, kind of, or at least get some more uh, exposure in the foreground so it kind of evens out. So, yeah, my composition is this beautiful lighthouse. Uh, so, I'm doing a couple of shots. Uh, I'm thinking both just horizontal picture, but I'm also going to do a vertical and then hopefully get some kind of nice pictures. I did get some nice pictures early today. Um, it was raining, but there was one of the pictures there came sunlight through the clouds and it shined up the whole foreground. So that one was really good, I think. At least it looks really good. So I hope the results on that one will turn out to be really good. So yeah, I'm kind of excited to see uh, that one. But yeah, the plan was some sunset photography first and then Milky Way. But it looks like you can see the sun has already gone past the clouds. And it doesn't look like there's going to be any breakage in these clouds. They're too thick. So I think this is just a waiting game for it, waiting game for it to be dark enough. And then we start with some nightscape. I think that's the plan. But this is a really beautiful place to be. Uh, I'm on, currently on top of this small hill here. And the, there's strong wind, but it's not cold. It's kind of refreshing. So it will be easy to kill some time right now. Just enjoy this beautiful sea breeze that's coming here. And then just, yeah, enjoy the view. So yeah, I hope you stay tuned and enjoy the pictures. All right. Thank you. 
yeah we have finished our mission today uh, it's really late now we stuck around the lighthouse for at least four hours five hours uh, we kind of uh, failed on the planning on the Milky Way it was a little bit more to the left than we wanted it to be in the beginning so we had to wait around uh, for it to, to be in the right place for the for a good composition so we just uh, stuck around took a lot of uh, time lapses and a lot of pictures and then in the end we got uh, I got a picture of the lighthouse with the Milky Way I think it looks really good I have to see in editing to see how it goes but uh, otherwise it was a really good night no clouds almost and uh, way better than the weather prediction said it would be uh, when it comes to the time lapse we it looked really weird taking a time lapse of the lighthouse it almost looked like a little disco ball on the top of the lighthouse that was an effect I was not aware of but I showed a uh, time lapse anyways and you can see <laughs> how it look how it looks um, but yeah otherwise it was a good night uh, a long night but still a good night and we got what we came for this was the main goal of the whole Kvitsøy, road trip to Kvitsøy so I guess tomorrow we're just gonna look around the island and see if we can find something else to do but yeah I hope you liked the episode and I'll see you in the next one all right bye bye Difficulties of changing battery during night time. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> oh.